Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Folklore. Um, my, my controller is on, good. Alright, so, um, we are going to go kick the boss's ass, basically. Um, I believe that's really all we've got left to do. Uh, just let me remind myself here how to kill him. Uh, yes, there it is. Sir Nunos, I believe, we're fighting, which I, yeah, I meant to look up, um, whether his name has any particular significance, but I completely forgot. Alright, so I, I need to punch his teeth out and then burn him. That's straightforward enough, I think. Oh, it would help if I would actually, um, actually do that. Uh, we're gonna put you... Yeah, that's a good place for you. And this is gonna go... Actually, we're gonna put that there. We're gonna put this up top. And then I'm gonna put this guy here, I think. I don't ever use the shield. I don't know why it's still there. So I'm gonna put this guy here. Yeah, it'll be good. Let's see how that works. It might be utterly useless, I don't know. But this game is taking its sweet time saving it. There we go. Alright, let's go. Let's go kick the boss's ass. What have you got to say to me? I think I've talked with this person already. Alright, I'll tell you. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Alrighty, let's be off. Oh, and uh, before I forget, um, somebody I, I speak to online on a regular basis, uh, September is for Sinners, has asked me to, uh, to sort of give a shout out. Oh my god, why are there so many of them? Dear sweet Jesus. Oh, that looks quite cool. Alrighty. Um, let's go, let's go. Oh, that is quite satisfying. But it doesn't seem to do a whole hell of a lot of- oh, nope, nope. Not what I wanted to do. Uh, I will- I will defeat him with this. It does not seem to do a whole hell of a lot of damage, though. Oh, there we are. Alright, well, that's fine. That's, uh... No, stop that. I don't- God damn it, that's not what I want to do. Ah, uh, no, I need to stop hitting the L button. Keep smacking the L button by accident, and it's not what I need to be doing. Alrighty. There we are. All of you. Rawr, die. Excellent. One, two, three, four, five, come on. Yes! Oh, that was satisfying. Alright. And then. Nope, wrong one. That is incorrect. Burn. There we are. What is this? Oh, there's another one of you. Hello. I will burn you. That was easy enough. Alright. Good, so that only took an entire age to defeat all of them. Uh, I missed completely. <laughs> Alright, there we are. And there's nothing there! There's nothing in there! Okay, great. Uh, what about this? Warm tree nuts. Warm tree nuts. And life drops. Hooray, because I was down so much HP after that. I don't, do they expect me to take a lot of damage in that fight, I wonder? I mean, it, it's really not that hard. I mean, they're attack when they attack you, they sit there and shake that stick at you for, like, an hour before they finally... It's like, it's just a solid three or four seconds before they actually hit you with it. I mean, you have plenty of time to move out of the way. Um, ooh, tentacles. I don't like tentacles. This reminds me of that critter in, uh... Oh, no, it no longer does, but... When it first shows up, it reminded me of that critter you fight in Dead Space, the, uh, the Leviathan, I think. Which every now and then you'd see the tentacles and you have to shoot the little yellow things off of it. I've never played Dead Space, by the way. Uh, nope. This. There we go, that's lock on. Yes. yes indeed. What do I, um... What do I... Do I just run up and attack it? Smack. Oh yeah, I just gotta punch him in the face. Alright, I can do that. Oh god, he's gonna shoot acid at me. Which one? No. No, you need to... Not out. Not fail as badly. Wow, that actually does like no damage at all. Oh, I see. Okay, so it's difficult because he's actually gonna move this time. Alrighty. Ah! <laughs> We're gonna stay away from you. Smack! Back up. Alright. I feel like whenever he does that, he's about to seriously beat the crap out of me. Go! Oh, hit him again! Hit him again! Smack him in the face again! This really is not terribly difficult. I mean... 
his his attack actually has some really limited range to it. But I can stand right here and smack him and not take any damage from it. The music is quite dramatic though. I'm a big fan. Is that nope. Oh come on, get back here. Let me smack you. I'm not finished with you. I'm not finished with you. I'm gonna keep bitch slapping you. Bitch slap, bitch slap, bitch slap. Over and over again. Alright, now what do I do? That was almost pathetically easy, actually. Okay, this is stage two, I guess? Maybe? I hope stage two is not as easy as stage one. I really don't. <laughs> go, go, Ke go, Keats, go. Run. I must have Kate. Who the hell is Kate? Kate is. Kate is a role playing character on a, on a website of mine. Oh, wait, what do I do? Yeah, this thing. Just, ow! Okay, good. He actually. Aha! Alright, well, that's good. Um, I might actually have some difficulty with this then. Come on, up! Oh, I see, that's the only way up. Alright, well, I need to wait. Come on! Come on! Get out of the way! Get out of the way! How am I supposed to. There we are. Ow. God damn. Yep, nope. God damn it. Alright, this is actually... Nope, that doesn't do anything. Okay, so I have to wait for these things to... to get down, which is bothersome. Okay, so I just I can just stand here, basically, is what this thing's telling me. Come on, we just fucking... Oh, Jesus. Okay, so just, uh... Just keep moving. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, until they... do this. Move up. Go back. Hopefully avoid them. Yes, and I'm stuck. This could be a bad thing. But, uh, I don't actually think it can hit me from here. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? Guys, guys, I found a use for the shield! Uh, we'll place that. Good. Yes. Yes! Yes, that's excellent! Oh, it's brilliant. Okay. I think I just made this a million and one times easier. Oh, said I was all out of... Yes, there we are. Yes. There we have it. Okay, we have to do this for an hour. It only goes down for like a half second here. I'm shocked that I didn't miss any of those. Alright. Come on. Sitting here twitching my controller up and down, expecting to smack my laptop here. Come on. I've lit him on fire. Surely he is not still doing a very good job fighting that. I wish catching Pokemon was this dynamic. This is pretty intense. Come on, one more. One more, we can do it! We can do it! Yes! Now, I want to know, do I get a superpower from him? Do I get a, a usable ability from him? Because I actually don't remember. I've beaten him before, like, years ago when I got this game, but I don't remember. That's disgusting. It just melts away. Now, I was standing on top of him. Surely Keats didn't just zoom out of the way that quickly. Maybe he did. Maybe, maybe he did. I don't know. That was fun. That was that was a lot of fun. It didn't take very long and it wasn't very difficult, but um but it was it was quite fun. I enjoyed it. Come on. And we're back to cutscenes again. Door in the middle of nowhere. How chic. <laughs> Keith, you are such a fabulous man. Sees a door in the middle of nowhere and goes, How chic. How chic. Is this the pub? Yes, this is the pub. Oh, there we are! Excellent. Talking deer head. This is brilliant. Get lost, chap, I'm busy. I can see you're busy. You look- you look very busy. You look like you're doing very important things up there. Can I really meet the dead? Haven't we gone over this already? This is really amusing to me, actually. Alright. Well, let's see... Oh, it's the teacher. Hopefully it's the real teacher this time.
I don't know if you can hear my button pushing, by the way, in the background. I'm holding the controller like an inch from the microphone, basically. Um, Ronaldo, Herb. Wasn't Herb that little creepy guy we found in the woods, the little boy? I don't know. We leave town, so I left. Protect her from what? Live life and be happy. She's a teenager. She's an angsty teenager. She is not willing to be happy right now. What happened to church? What happened to the little boy at church? Hmm, I wonder. What is that it? Is that all the time I get, I get from her? What the fuck? What the? Yeah, my thoughts exactly, Keith. What the? <laughs> Called a Nemeza. Oh, that's right. Okay. Ew. You just covered me in bug guts. Absolutely covered me in bug guts. Thanks. And now I'm hallucinating. Brilliant. Revenge is near. Ooh. Alright, great. So I'm hallucinating someone else's memories. Brilliant. What did you say? I said revenge is near. That night at the church, Herb got molested. I mean... <laughs> I'm sorry, this is just... Uh, I'm quite sure this is not what they meant with the game. But, um... Beloved daughter Ellen, forgive me for being absent from your life. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay. Yeah, we went over this. Herb got molested at the church 17 years ago. And died, apparently. Hello, Belgay. The door disappears behind me. Discover anything useful? Questionably so, and now I'm covered in bug guts. Do you have a handkerchief? As many as stars in the sky. Hopefully, I won't need to, um, to search through all of them. I think there are, like, five or six chapters for each, each person. Oh, I can move now. Uh, I don't want to go that way. I want to go... Oh, wait, I think I'm meant to go back to, uh, back to the town at this point. I believe. Uh, yes, I will save. Save right here. Yes. And, um... Yeah. See if completed. All right. And now let's go to Doolin. Let's go. Oh wait. I wonder if I can talk to the uh, the this guy at the top of the lapping stairs. It doesn't look like it because there's that guy still standing there. But <laughs> all the way up the stairs. Call the fairy lord. No outsider. Yeah, I didn't think so. <laughs> Back down the stairs. Creepy children's laughter. Okay. Alright, let's go back to Doolin. Yes, it is okay to return to Doolin Village. At least I hope it's okay. Well, that's quite cool. You know, if that were me, I would not be so inclined to just run right through that door, but, uh, you know. Okay. So, uh, we need to go talk to Ellen again, I believe? And all the way back from the cave. You know, it's a good thing that Keats never seems to get tired. He's a very athletic guy. He's got a runner's build, apparently. And he really doesn't have a runner's build. He's got, like, a... anorexic-type build, actually, is what he really has. He's got long legs, so we'll say he's a good runner. Alright, back to Ellen's hut. All the way over here. At least I think that's where we're going. Are we? I don't know. Uh, let's visit Suzette, Suzette first, because, um, this whole thing, I mean, the plot really does kind of revolve around her family. I don't know, I feel like Ellen is just kind of stuck in so far. I mean, I'm sure she actually gets involved in the plot later, but I really do kind of feel like she's just sort of stuck into the plot right now. Hmm. 
Father died. Da -da 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 -da. She's pregnant with you. Then how did you miraculously make your way back? You just appear there? Someone beat me to the story. I don't think anyone is going to write this in any newspaper but you. Because you are a sadistic bastard who thrives on the unhappiness of others. <laughs> oh, by the way, be happy. Alright. Can I go? Because I think I'm going to go... I think I need to go talk to Ellen now, right? Either that or it's going to make me appear back in Keith's place. Nope, we're going to fade back in exactly where we left off, except now it's nighttime. Oh, I can move. Alright. Uh. I want to know what happened, and apparently it's my duty to find out. Keith, get your hands out of your pockets. You look like a slob. Loading screen. Oh, PlayStation, how I love you and your loading screens. Okay, let's go talk to Ellen. No, we're going to run three feet and then hit another cutscene. Excellent. We couldn't just guide ourselves smoothly into the cutscene. No, you had to give me the illusion of freedom. Let me grasp at it. Let me run those three feet and then then hit me hit me with another cutscene. Oh, hello. I kind of wish I wasn't fast-forwarding there because that would have been slightly creepier had I not been. Who, who was that, anyway? Nothing there. No, there was definitely a creepy cultist lady there. Great, and now he's self-narrating. Brilliant. I could be going mad. You don't say. Yeah, there was definitely a creepy cultist lady there. And, um... I don't know. Personally, I think she looked kind of like... Um... What was that woman's name? Levine? No, it wasn't Levine. It was... Le something. La Chandra, no. I really have it was less something, I don't know. That lady with the Princess Amidala thing. Oh my god, wow, that was it already? We're done? Alright, well this is a, a short video, I guess. Um I was going to just record this one tonight, but uh I'll I guess I'll record another one because that was quite short. Alright. Well, next time, uh we will do Ellen. And um Yeah. We will see uh, what it was that she was poking her nose into while, uh, while Keats was running around beating the crap out of mud flower turtles. Alright, until then.